Well, after being back uh, for a couple of weeks now, I still seem to not be able to shake off this uh, congestion I have, but uh, hopefully it will be gone by next week. Uh, I apologize to those um, people who are waiting for me to come and visit them in nursing homes. Uh, but with this, I can't take the risk of passing whatever I have on to you. So please be patient and um, I'll be there as soon as I can. Uh, this Sunday is Mission Sunday, and the Church asks us to help by our prayer and our practical charity to assist those missionaries throughout the world who take the Gospel of Christ. And that good news is still being spread throughout the world. Uh, indeed, in the Synod on Synodality in the Vatican that's taking place at the moment will focus on this during this coming week. Our schools are also having Mission Week. And it's a great time for our young people in our schools to be able to understand that there are people who believe so much that they give up their life or part of their life to take the word of God to people in places that we would not go. So I ask you to be generous in your charity. Uh, the envelopes were given out last week or they will be available again this week for you to pick up and to place on one of the collections. Hopefully, as we continue uh, to spread the word of God, we may make that part of our own family life, to encourage each other to celebrate the Sunday Eucharist and to pray for those who are in need of encouragement. Um, I've written to the parents in the sacramental program and I've asked them to remember the promise that they made to bring their children up in the practice of the faith. So if you are a grandparent of one of those children or a friend, you might remind them as well. That would be a great way for you to evangelize. So thank you and may the good Lord go with you.